just like to welcome all the uh, teams, coaches and players and families to the facility and I hope you enjoy the weekend and I encourage you to uh, explore our great community. Coming here from Redwater, Alberta and I've been here for about three weeks now and a uh, very warm uh, opening community and mayor and council and administration has been great to work with, obviously in this great facility. The project itself, the overall recreation facility itself, has been uh, surprising how successful it has been. We predicted when we presented all our cases to the community and to government as to why we should be building something like this in our community and what impact it will have. I, I honestly think we underestimated just how much it could do or, or couldn't fully appreciate, I guess, what we were saying at the time. The, the facility, the, this building, this beautiful arena, has managed to attract already a large concert. We had more than a thousand people here to country music, CMT hit list concert. We've got uh, more hockey games happening all the time. We've got people who want to come here and take part. We've got tournaments coming from other locations. And we've got everybody who comes here is just awestruck by the by how nice this building is and how well it presents. So uh, as we talk about our facility, um, we do have our rental space in the hall and we do have a boardroom that is great for any non-profit or commercial company to use and once again I just direct everybody to the website www.verdonparksandrecreation.ca Okay I'm standing just outside of our boardroom here and we are situated right on our running track that goes around the whole facility. So once again good for hockey camps, for cross training, for dry land training as well. Uh, just optimum use for any ice sport that you can do your dry land on and then go into the classroom and do any of your video footage replay on. The hall that we have, it's a 500 seat hall. We've had, we've only been open since June, but we've had at least three or four events now that have managed to have more than 300 people at it. We've never had a hall that size before. So now that we are able to have that, we've, we've had these events with, with those many people at it, and tens of thousands of dollars have been raised in these, in these functions. It's just been quite incredible. The return on investment has been instantaneous for our community. Of course, we're not done. We have a curling arena that we want to complete, and we're looking forward to getting that done. Can't help but notice, we've got 1,200 seats, individual seats for people, so you could sell out quite well for those events. And that doesn't include the standing room that's available. With the 1,200 seat seating for our arena, it's a great facility to host concerts, figure skating shows, hockey tournaments, and once again, all that information is available on our website. This is a, a world-class facility here uh, that we do have and uh, we are looking at just ways of utilizing it. We do have world-class figure skaters uh, that are currently using, using the ice. Um, also junior hockey uh, potentially coming into town will also be uh, another big step for the facility. And uh, just as you're monitoring our progress with the facility, I encourage everybody to visit our website at www verdonparksandrecreation.ca and for all municipal updates visit our website at www.verdon.ca So I'd just like to thank the host committee for putting in countless hours of work in the organization of this tournament and to all the volunteers for game day for all their hard work that they put in to make this tournament a great success.